Crash Bandicoot War! Welcome back everyone to the Crash Bandicoot video series. I think this time away to focus on Spooktober was definitely a good one because now I'm able to focus better on Crash and so on and so forth. You know, time away from a frustrating game, even though a lot of the frustration came from myself, but still that's regardless. Anyway, let us continue on this magical journey through Crashland. Oh, we're actually fighting Cortex with this one. All right, let's do it. Oh boy. Yeah, so they're really wanting us to go with the uh, double jump mechanics. Oops. Careful, careful, careful. Spectre is always so damn tricky. All right, checkpoint. Got the crystal. That's all I care about. Just want to finish this damn game. Oops! I jumped over that. All right, all right. I will admit though, the robot designs for these guys are kind of cute. Oh my God, I forgot I had this. I had a mango gun the whole time. Double jumped. I double jumped there. Don't care, didn't ask, cry about it, stay mad, get real L mauled seed cope. Crystal, that's all that counts. <laughs> Orange asphalt. Ooh. Another racing. God, this is gonna piss me off. All right. Onward. Holy shit! Fucking cops. I was too distracted. Oh my god. Fuck it, we're restarting. Oh my god, this is fucking infuriating. I'm already in seventh. Just gotta keep the lead. Six. Come on. Second try, second try. Come on, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Ramp. 
That's no fair. How come they don't get a speed penalty when they go over the ash? Do the good dirt. Ah, fuck. I'm so close, I'm so close. Come on. Yes! I don't care about the boxes. We got the crystal. We won. Second try this shit. Hoorah. God, there's so much to hate about this game, but at the same time, there's just so much love and attention that's been put into it. Oops. Yeah, 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 game over. Moving on. Hold up. Did I? Oh, shit. That's kind of cool. <laughs> wow, that just makes the game... Okay... No! Oh. The fuck? All right. Wait, what's over there? Fuck it, we'll risk it. Nope, it's nothing. Ooh. Oh, that was too close. how the carpets are shaped like fucking uh, dollar bills. <laughs> like, look at the pattern on them and tell me that's not, it doesn't look like some kind of currency. Ooh. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. We're still...
so stupid how broken this whole rocket launcher thing makes it. <laughs> and the implication that you just crush a guy underneath a bunch of fucking furniture and fluid. Ooh, no, I'm not doing the skull and crossbow. Just gonna complete the game normally. His coconut gun fires and spurts. What the fuck? Had to fucking nail the music. They they're giving me so many fucking reasons not to hate this game more than I fucking do. On one hand, I'm not a fan of the fact that the perspective really messes with the aim controls of this stupid thing. Bonus level, why not? Get level designers. got all the diamonds. <laughs> this titanium blade can cut through diamonds. Joke's on you. I'm not wearing any diamonds. Oh, another aerial. Can't wait to see how this one gets fucked up. Rash, Coco, remember, it is not only Dr. Cortex that we battle. Beware of Uka Uka, my children. He is a far more dangerous enemy than anyone can imagine. Hmm. One bomber. Yeah, 
<laughs> I'm an aerial ace. Come back now. Ah, mayday, mayday. Red leader standing by. Green leader standing by. Gold leader standing by. Red button standing by. Red fox standing by. Big red standing by. Red October standing by. Helen Reddy standing by. Simply red standing by. Ah, mayday! Yeah, I got it! <laughs> Just in time. Suck it, bitches! I'm out! Oh, back to Angel Jeep Ship we go. Bug light. Oh my god, stop. That's such a stupid pun. Bug light. That's so dumb. Why is it so dumb? So this is just like the... Uh, it's gonna let me see or
Oh, shit. I was so close. And I screwed the bonus level. <laughs> oh my god, see that is a that's a really creative level, but at the same time, fuck that level. That's so annoying. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is the part where I'm supposed to be angry, full of rage, incensed beyond belief. Once again, you have outsmarted and outspun my best henchmen. I should be rather upset, shouldn't I? And in fact, we're furious! But it seems you have overlooked one small detail, you little orange delivery boy. Now that you have gathered all the crystals, all we have to do is take them from you! Good luck! Crash uh. <laughs> Bandicoot, for the last time! Give the crystals to me! Gotcha. <laughs> okay, this is a fun idea for a boss fight. Oh, holy crap. Alright, putting everything I've learned to the test. Oops. I was not paying attention. And I can't get any help from this guy here because I'm he's busy fighting Uka Uka. Oh. No! God damn it! Okay, notice up. Keep away from Cortex and Oh my god, this perspective is really messing with my head. Don't care, didn't ask, cry about it, stay mad, get real L mauled seed cope. I'm so used to the tiki masks being shorter. Or smaller.
damn it. Two, bitch. At least Cortex sticks around in the upper part, so he's easy to track. But it's the masks that I need to watch out for. There we go. <laughs> the way Ukuka just rolls his fucking eyes like this fucking idiot. Incarcerated. Run faster while holding down the R2 button. Oh. Yep, let's get out of here. Defeated again. This is not fair. Maybe I should retire to a nice big beach with a nice big drink and a woman with nice big. Hold on. Bag up. Bags of ice for my head. It's not <laughs> over, Bandicoot. There are still the Zens. We still have a chance to triumph. <laughs> I'm sorry, gems. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, so that means there's a fucking completionist route. <laughs> I'm not fucking doing that. I am not doing that. God damn it. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy. This is, this is the finale. And oh my lord, I, I don't want to do it. Like, okay, so it was fun to play the game and see where it all started. But at the same time, controversial hot take, but I'm, I'm not going to want to do this again. It was fun to play these games, but that's, that's my number one complaint about these games, is the fact that they're a remaster, they use the original mechanics, but I'm sorry, sometimes the original mechanics just aren't up to snuff and I am a firm believer that when you make a remake you should also take the time to fix a lot of the issues that were in the originals such as the bad C axis and kind of wonky hitboxes were a lot of the deaths my fault most certainly but other times it wasn't quite properly portrayed where things were relative to you, which resulted in a lot of hits that you could hear me complain should not have hit me. Or the number of times I would seemingly jump over something only for it to still hit me, which is just the pinnacle it, it's, see it's very much like you want to design your game to be difficult but you don't want your player 
to accuse it of being unfair. And yes, as the games went on, especially with Crash Bandicoot 3, they very much worked on that, and they very much made it so that you could see the threats as they were coming at you. But the main issue is, again, just the issues with the Z-axis and the issues with the overall hitboxes because of that confusing Z-axis. Where were things relative to you? Overall, though, this is a solid, solid 6 out of 10. It's a solid 6 out of 10 game, just slightly above average because, like I said, as the games progressed, they really tried to focus on either giving you things that would avoid the issues with the, the Z-axis, but like I mentioned with the coat, with that mango gun, sometimes because of that confusing Z-axis, aiming with that gun was not very fun. But I think that'll just about wrap it up. Unless... Oh! A few moments later. Oh, nope, I'm not doing that again. So I need to collect all the boxes in order to get the gems. It's so stupid. I hate this. I actually hate this. Nope, we're not doing any more of this. See you guys on the next time.